Ever pondered the question, does age define the pursuit of dreams? Is there an invisible clock constantly ticking, whispering that your time to chase your aspirations is running out? Well, brace yourself for an enlightening journey that will surely debunk the myth that age dictates one's pursuit of dreams. Take for instance the story of Harry Bernstein. He spent a lifetime in the shadows working as an editor for a construction magazine. But beneath the surface he nurtured a dream of becoming a writer. It wasn't until he reached the age of 93 that he published his first book, The Invisible Wall. The book, a poignant memoir of his childhood, received rave reviews and led to three more books, proving that age is no barrier to fulfilling one's dreams. Then there's the tale of Fao Jia Singh who took up marathon running at the age of 89. He ran his first marathon at 90 and went on to set multiple world records in his age group. His story is a testament to the fact that it's never too late to take up a new hobby or sport. And age is just a number when it comes to chasing one's passions. Or consider the story of Grandma Moses. She didn't pick up a paintbrush until she was in her 70s. Despite her late start, her folk art paintings became a sensation, displaying in galleries and museums around the world. Her journey clearly shows that creativity has no expiry date, and it's never too late to explore your artistic side. As these inspiring stories demonstrate, age is not a limitation, but merely a number. It is never too late to pursue your dreams, to change your career, or to learn a new skill. The key is to believe in yourself, to persevere, and to never let age dictate what you can or cannot do. To summarize, Harry Bernstein, Fauja Singh, and Grandma Moses all prove that age is no barrier to achieving dreams. Regardless of how old you are, it's never too late to chase your aspirations. The only limitations that exist are the ones you place on yourself. So, remember, age is just a number, and your dreams are waiting for you to reach out and grasp them. It's not about the years in your life, but the life in your years that truly counts. So, as the notes of red dirt country music fade away, remember these stories. Hold on to them as reminders that age is just a number and that it's never too late to chase your dreams. As the saying goes, the best time to plant a tree was 20 years ago. The second best time is now. So go ahead, plant your tree today and let it grow. After all, dreams don't have an expiry date.